In the verses of other poets is too much making, and the heart's immediacy is lost. What comes from the heart is good. The product of words shall not be preferred. What do you think that means? Hi everyone, welcome to day one of quarantine here in Taipei, Taiwan. I'm so stoked to be here, so excited. And it's actually crazy to me that I'm here because 24 hours ago, I didn't know whether or not I was gonna make it here. If you watched my vlog, my COVID test wasn't the type that the Taiwan CDC listed out. So that was a big concern. Anyways, like I said, today is day one of quarantine and I'm just so grateful to be here, like look at how gorgeous the sky is, I don't know if you guys can see, the sky is absolutely breathtaking. If you guys don't know, the Taiwanese government requires anyone from overseas to conduct a 14 day mandatory government mandated quarantine period and if you leave your designated area that you listed on your like immigration forms then you will be fined i think like i want to say a hundred thousand dollars that might be a little extreme but i'm gonna have to check up on that but it's a lot of money we're gonna be staying put here because first of all we don't have that kind of money and just follow the rules just follow the rules that's why taiwan is doing so great with controlling covid so big props to them i do have a class i have to attend but other than that the only thing else i have planned for today is to clean up my room because my room is actually embarrassing a mess and then the second task is that i did get a package from the government so i'm going to be doing an unboxing of that and um groceries because i love watching like people do like grocery unboxings when they're abroad because like you know we love being a little cultured so yeah and let's just get started with the night Before we do anything, we're supposed to text in this group chat how we're feeling today. So everyone's like, good morning, I'm doing well, I'm doing great. This group specifically is with foreigners. So those who are um, in Taiwan with a special visa, the person who's like monitoring the chat, you also have his contact information. So if you need anything, you can just contact him directly. Every morning you just text, good morning, um, text hello, no symptoms today, doing fine, doing great. It's get it's probably gonna get a little tedious because everyone says the same thing and like use the same stickers. This is how the government makes sure that we're all at home and quarantined. And then once two week quarantine period is over, the person who mo is monitoring you will kick you out. So um, I'm excited to be kicked out of this group chat when the time comes. <laughs> because we're supposed to separate our waste from like everyone else's so thank you to them so look how much groceries we got and then we have one more bag here so we have milk i don't know something about taiwanese milk just like tastes better than american milk i don't know what they put in it but i just love taiwanese milk some orange juice yogurt because i'm planning on making like a parfait for breakfast oranges and look at how big 
jelly thing I got. Oh, I don't know, but this is for dessert. What's fun about this is that it's made out of 100% recycled materials. The Ramen cereal. These are my favorite type of cereals. In the States, this thing, like this little bag, this is I think 500 grams plus like $12. Midnight snack. Mouthwash. I love this mouthwash. I don't know why, but something just hits different about Japanese mouthwash. We made our breakfast. I cut some oranges and then the granola that I bought this morning and some yogurt to make this little parfait thing. One of my goals for this quarantine is to do a little bit of reading. I picked up these two books. They were actually recommended through TikTok. <laughs> the person who uh, um, recommended say, said that you have to read these two books before you die. So this one's called The Alchemist. It's by Paulo Coelho. Co Coelho? He's a Portuguese writer. I didn't really read the summary too much because I like going into things like blindly. And this was actually also recommended by BTS Yoongi. Uh, so that's also another reason why I picked this book up. The next book is How to Win Friends and Influence People. I'm sure the title just gives it away. Hopefully after reading this, I can become a persuasive communicator and a more efficient leader. One philosophical and then one psychological. I'm, I think I'm gonna lean towards this one because I want a more fictional read, a more relaxed read. Oh my God, I was gonna lay outside and read my book. But then I saw this guy. Holy crap, this thing is huge. What are you doing here? Look, look at my hand and look at him. Please don't come near me. But like, look how big that thing is. Oh. I've been feeling so, I've been feeling so down, yeah Can you tell me why, can you tell me why I'm down, yeah No friends of mine, no friends of mine around, yeah Now I'm thinking now, now I'm thinking now Might have caught the June blues, yeah I wanna try myself inside the juice Okay,好,谢谢。Lunch <笑> is coming! Lila! <笑>谢谢! Yeah.
Japan. Do, do, do. It's a little past four now, and for the first day of quarantine, I uh, think we did pretty well. I did a little bit more reading after lunch and some homework, but overall, I'd say quarantine day number one was a 10 out of 10. I'm going to do a little self-care, watch some BTS in the soup. If you guys have any um, TV or film recommendations, please let me know because I do have quite a bit of time on my hands right now. So I would love to know what you guys are watching right now or anything you're interested in. And thank you guys so, so much for watching. And I'm excited to show you guys what this little island has to offer once quarantine is over. Please stay tuned and I will talk to you guys very soon. In the meantime, please stay safe, stay happy, smile, and wear a mask. Okay, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! We love domestic BTS.